Have you ever wanted to watch Jason Statham use a plate to beat up a guy? Now that Meg 2 is plunging headfirst into the cinematic high seas, it seems like the ideal moment to firmly establish this awful allegory and reflect on Jason Statham's life before he became a professional shark fighter. Ten years ago, the staff was producing action flicks that were simple, incredibly entertaining, and reminiscent of the golden age of actors like Stallone, Schwarzenegger, or Van Damme and safe is among his greatest, and most underappreciated, works. Played by Statham, Luke Wright has a fascinating background as a black operations soldier, city cop, cage fighter, and now retired military guy. Luke is punished by the Russian mafia for inadvertently sending an opponent to the hospital during a planned battle. They also kill his wife and threaten to kill anyone he speaks to going forward. After a year, Luke finds himself on the streets, living alone. He helps May, a young girl who is being chased by some goons, while he is thinking of killing himself. May, a math prodigy, is made to work for Han Jio, the boss of the trio. The Russian mafia, the triad, and a group of dishonest city police officers would do anything to get their hands on the lengthy code she has committed to memory. All Luke and May can do is run and figure out the code first. One straightforward question sums up the debate over whether or not to watch safe. Are you interested in seeing Jason Statham bash a man with a dinner plate? If the response is no, please leave right away. I want the best for you. If the response is in the affirmative, then good news. You've found all the crockery-based fighting you've been searching for.